well, three years later, I think, and I was recording vlogs about uh, Collective Soul Song December. Turn your head now, baby, just spit me out. And as I went to hit the record button, I remembered uh, just today, I think I realized that what, what that means is turn your head and just pick me out. It's talking about earwax. Um, I wasn't planning on mentioning that. Okay, so just a couple of things after uh, very intensely, I don't know what's the word, just very closely listening to the song of uh, Hocus Pocus on a Great Malenko album uh, that I'm about to load in the background. There's like the first hip hop dance maneuver. So in one of my videos that I don't have, this is what hip hop is from Brandy, not Brandy, Blondie Rapture song. There's a guy doing this. It's a hip hop. As Grandmaster Kaz says in um, MC Delight, uh, one of the rappers Delight, he says, I'll break your hip. Break your hip, make it hop. That's like what hip hop is right there. And that was in one of my videos that didn't end up working out. Because uh, if the power crashes or the phone overloads and overheats and just ends up crashing, so that's an M right there. That's for Malenko, uh, from David to Malenko. What is it? If I don't hit this uh, stop recording button uh, before the sh phone shuts down, or sometimes the app just crashes too and just disappears. Um, the file will remain there and it's completely like encoded in a way that it's, I don't know what it, what's there. So um, hopefully I can either email the company of Camera File Live with the attached files that I need them to decrypt. That's not even important. So, I was thinking about the peace sign. There's been some articles about what it means. It's supposed to be kind of like, I am not a crook type thing. Like throwing hands up in surrender. Because it looks like a Y. Or like saying like Y. But it's actually, the peace sign is the only like reasonable response, I just realized this week or last week, to a middle finger. Right? So if someone, like getting flipped off, is it like an act of war? then the peace sign is like the reply to that. It's two, two fingers up. And so that's the main theme of a Hocus Pocus song. Um, and I'm just hearing uh, the chorus when the ladies, female juggalos in the background say, Hocus Pocus, Joker's wild, come take a spin on a carny ride. Using two hands to count the syllables, that's the first way to try to start um, editing music and to make it into a new song is to count the syllables and it has to match. For example, on Saturday Night Live, they spoofed, the ch the, he had the crowd chanting on the news report uh, weekend update, uh, Kyle from Saturday Night Live on Saturday, he was saying, let's go bananas, but it doesn't fit in with the thing. Let's go bananas, there's too many syllables. What's happening? Oh, camera crash. Uh, camera fight. Anyways, um, he actually says, let's go bad noodles, but what he's saying is bat blank, the S word. Bat blank, let's go bat blank, like Batman or something. I'm not going to mention it. Um, so the idea is counting syllables in the song Hocus Pocus. In the chorus, they say, Hocus Pocus, Joker's wild, come take a spin on a carny ride, and it's seven syllables. And so, um, I'll have to have this song going, and I just have to remind myself of what the dance moves are, because it's different when I'm recording. Usually I have the phone sitting down and with my headset on. Um, what else? There was a couple of things. Um, I'm, even, I'm not even checking out. That's a new rug there. It's a jump to conclusions, Matt has different conclusions that you can jump to from office space. Um, it's my shirt resembling Clockwork Orange. Um, all right, so there's two songs on this playlist. What, was that? what else was I going to say? What were the other dance moves? Um, mentioned in the song is 
And I'm making this video because I found like a TikTok compilation on YouTube of it going viral, just the intro of this song. So I'm going to do the whole song and the next song in my auto generated playlist. Uh, how much power I got? 7%. I should probably have a, a part two going on. Uh, so let me just compare uh, the song Hocus Pocus to Insane in the Membrane. Um, the idea of membrane is what else is there parts of the brain? There's membrane, frontal lobe, cerebellum, and stuff like that. So in the chorus is insane in the membrane. Instead of saying insane in the brain, it should be insane in the cerebellum. It's too many syllables, right? It doesn't fit. Um, and he says, that's why I don't mess with the big 4-0. So it's like four in circle. I don't know if that's American Sign Language or what. Um, kind of like this is a three down here. Like, it says Nucky, as in Lucky, on my uh, shirt, so now it says Mucky. Alright, so, um, what, what else? And he says, talk about chopping, chopping a house down, that's the axe symbolism of the band, of the album Great Malenko and St. Kong Posse. Um, there's also Posse in Effect, Beastie Boy song. I think that was the first, Paul Revere was the first time I counted syllables to try to recreate a different version of it. Um, someone on a forum online had wrote this long story of their life, and so I turned it into Paul Revere uh, just by counting syllables and trying to make it match. Um, there's a few more things. He says, call me a blanking, blanking freak, B, and I'll call you by your name, freak. Uh, kind of like Induce Bigelow. Uh, that's a you. Anyways, uh, uh, in the, the third song where there's supposed to be a third verse, it's just blank, and it goes down, 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 like uh, Snake Charmer. And that's when I have the same thing. I say, back like blank and blank, scoliosis, call me, call me a king blank, and I'll call you by your name, B. Freak. Anyways, it's really, really out there. So I'll record part two. Um, I just, I can very quickly the songs sometimes um, here's where the phone's gonna crash so if I open up YouTube three percent all right so here is just in my home feed two auto generated playlist okay and I can add these to my uh, list so let me check this one out I didn't save the library them to my library list of lists. Okay, so I'm gonna click it. And there's certain parts of the song. Let me go to that part with the down no 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 no. I hope this is working. That's where I count the syllables and there's seven. Mm, might be for the And this really sounds like Tony Montana. Also featured in the uh, song MC Delight, Grandmaster Kaz, uh, from 2008. It's a remake of Rapper's Delight. Were you trying to get crazy with this scene? Oh, uh, very quickly, the, the sound that's like, in that song, it's just a wah with a hand like this, wah. It's just the move there. So anyways, hopefully I can record a, a dancing video over here with the songs. <laughs> 